All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game, One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Team Fight Tactics Game 3. Game 3. If we reach Game 4, I'm going to... I, I'm kind. I I really want to play Call to the Lamb. I wasn't I wasn't planning on this being this long of a playthrough. This was definitely a joke when I started it, but now here we are, trying to stay alive for the third time. So we are Bronze One now. We've been promoted to Bronze One, almost Silver Four. So yeah, we'll see. Renekton up. Let's go. So first game we won with Eight Brawler. Second game we won with Civilian Sure Shot. First game we won convincingly. Second game was not so convincing. So that second game was close. That was really close, but we pulled it out. Now the mystery is, what are we playing this time? I'd like to play something we haven't yet. Oh, wow. Uh, that's not great. That's not great. Double recurve. Let's sell that one. Double duelists. I mean, if we end up playing duelists, I guess it could work out. We could do a, uh, maybe like a Rage Blade Runins or Last Whisper, uh, Rage Blade. There's options if we go duelist, I guess. There's the Rage Blade. I mean, it's kind of coming together a little bit here. Maybe we could play Laser Core Duelist? Go duelists here. Uh, I do like laser core duelists. Laser core and duelists bounce off each other pretty well, and it's got a Zed carry built in. I could see us doing that. All right, are we getting? We got to be getting a champion this time. We've gotten items the last two times. Wow, double execution to the head there. Oh, a Velkaz. <gasps> Give me loaded dice. Do it. Ah! Ah! <laughs> um, no, I don't like any of that. Refresh. Jesus. Well, screw me, huh? Team has a 100% strike uh, crit chance when we have a Draven on the field, at least. So I guess we'll do that. That's unfortunate. It's not at all what I wanted to see. I was really hoping for better than that. Um, this isn't doing anything for us. Could put the Rage Blade on the Velkaz and just let it go to work. We have no front line. That's alright. Silver Lux already. Yikes. Okay, get the execute with the Draven, maybe? No, it's not happening. Well, we killed two. I think we're taking a lost streak this game. Yep, yep. I don't see this one going any better than that. We, we... God, our hero augment, man. Are you serious? <laughs> That's tough. That's tough. All right. We couldn't get anything for what we were trying to do. Anila tank, though. Hold up now. And we can definitely grab this monkey in case we go Mecha Prime for some reason. Um. The hammer does most of the work. Let's see. Uh, I'll just have to... If I do it on Draven, I'll have to keep a Draven on the wing. Yeah. We'll have to keep a Draven around for the future. Um, on our bench so that we can keep it. 100% crit chance is what this gives you. So, even though the Augment didn't help the kind of team we were trying to run, 100% crit chance is very good. Don't get me wrong. Everybody's got 100% crit chance. That's pretty good on its own. So maybe we go for wins once we get going here. This would have been great. Spirit of the Exile. That would have been so good for what we were planning to do. Another duelist. I, never hold back. I, st 
still think we're going duelists. I still think so. Let me, um... Yeah, screw it. Let's go for the win streak. Four duelist, one ace. Everybody's getting attack speed. Draven's getting it because of the Rage Blade, and all the duelists are getting it because they're duelists. Is this guy going the Omni Vamp? No, he's going Spirit of the Exile. He's just not actually using it because they're all grouped up. That's interesting. Yeah, I think we can. I think we can grab some wins. This guy had 100 HP, and we grabbed a win against him. Hammer does most of the work. I just swing it. 100% crit chance. That means he doesn't need an Infinity Edge. Oh my god, there's spats out here. We got third pick, so we probably won't get it, but that's kind of crazy. If we could get a Duelist Draven? Whoa, 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 whoa. That would actually be so good. Give us the spat. This is it. We're getting it. We're getting a spat. Come on. Yes. Oh my god. Let's go. We could do eight duelists this game, if we wanted to. That would be tough to do. We'd have to get a hell of a tanky Nihila, but that would be so much damage. With everybody having a 100% crit chance? I know this guy's a duelist too, but... Yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, that's so good. We're not doing mech. So let's get the interest. And then if we find a Yasuo or a Vayne, we've got six duelists. Already. That's spicy. That is spicy. Let them know what we're made of right now. Because we're looking real nice. Yep, we're cooking. Look at that attack speed everybody's got. Yeah, we dig that. It wasn't the plan we were originally going for, but it worked out. This cap's at 5. He's nowhere near 5, so... Yeah, he can still get plenty more attack speed. Um, I guess we don't need laser core, then. If we're going straight duelist. Just vertical duelist. No, we don't. Alright. Well, we still could, because two of these are laser cores, but not likely. There we go. Two interest, win streak. Nuts of floppin apparently, is really dangerous. But if we don't fight Nuts of floppin I, I, I like our chance. And what a name, by the way. We're up against Dingleberry, who's at 68 HP already. You know he's hurt. He is not feeling good. There it is. Get him out of here. I will not fall to you. So Nuts of Floppin' and, and us are on a win streak right now. He's on a five win streak, so he made more money than us because we lost our first fight, but... Okay. <sighs> Still not finding that other duelist yet. I'll sell this Gangplank for interest if I have to, but I'd like to not have to. And the fact that he has Ace means that Draven executes on 12% health. So if we get him low, Draven could just execute right there. The fact that everybody's critting is just huge. It's what's making this work in the first place. Another recurve? Are you serious? Another Rage Blade? Are you serious? Whoops, I didn't need to sell that. I thought I was going to need to, but I didn't. Another Rage Blade? I don't think that's actually good on Draven right now. He's got enough attack speed. Yeah, that's that's just overkill. So, we're going to say no to that. We could do a Runins on him, maybe? But even that's kind of, like, iffy. Because then he has no lifesteal. And if he has no lifesteal, I don't like his odds of staying alive. I don't know, let's see what the next augment is. God, if we get nuts of flopping, I'm crying. I 
I, I prepared the best I could for nuts. Okay, we got Ague. With the giant Alice there. Silver already. Nyla's not going to be able to heal in time. Good heal, though, once it finally got going. The attack speed is nice. He's got a misfortune? Whoa, 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 whoa. Why does he have a misfortune? An Ox Force misfortune with Death's Defiance at that. Oh, yeah, we lost that for sure. Damn it, there goes our win streak again. How the f... That's crazy. All right, well, that's what we're up against. Tiny Titans, Recombobulator, Ludens. Uh, definitely Tiny Titans, I guess, because I like what I have. There's a Duelist. Six Duelists right there. We didn't find the Yasuo we f or the Vein. We found the Zack, or the Zed, of all things. Interesting. Okay. We could give him a Rage Blade, too, I guess. Wouldn't hurt. But I think I'd rather give him Runins or something. He needs Lifesteal. Almost positive on that. But Runins would be good on him. Especially with the executes he has. Let's go here. Alright, now we're facing Nuts of Floppin'. And I think we lose this. He's looking really beefy. Look how tough that Blitz is. Oh yeah, this this LeBlanc's gonna eat us. Oh, and he's got a Belveth. Everybody's getting four costs out here. Ah, uh, getting first in this one's gonna be really hard. Another Nyla, nice. Okay. We have a lot of HP because of Tiny Titans. We can buy some time. Yasuo is going to be hard to find just because there's people playing it as their hero champ. Oh my god. Mordekaiser. <laughs> nice recombobulate. Yeah, he recombobulated on his augment. Did he silver a misfortune? And a silver misfortune? Bro, he's disgustingly strong. Are we... Who? Egu? No, nobody's beating that, by the way. So, Egu is one. I'm pretty sure that we're going to end at three games. I'll try my best. But that's a lot. That is so much to have to contend against. He lost? Against who? Who has Yumi in the back? Was it Hot Pot? No, it was Kigs. With the carry Yumi. Oh my god. Alright, I need a I need a BF. Okay. I could also runins right now. Ah no, we need we need lifesteal. Probably. Nice Nyla. Yeah, it does 140% attack damage. Yeah. Uh, that's tough. Mm. I don't know. Probably? Let's go. The more HP we save now, the better. Oh, God, we're up against Kigs. This is the guy that just beat Egu, the absolute monster. So let's be aware of that. The Talia, I bet, is a big part of it. Get that out of here, please. Are we gonna beat him? No way. Oh my god, we did! <laughs> wow, we beat the guy who beat the giant. Let's go! Okay. I think I'm going to start rolling at 7... No, we need to go to 8 anyway to put 8 Duelist in. So, never mind. We'll just have to do what we do here. Oh, 
I kind of like putting Fiora in as a sacrifice. Gold member, hot pot. Dingleberry is getting stronger. Down to 42 HP, though. Dingleberry is running out of time to get strong enough. Let's see if Dingleberry's got it now. That Sunfire is going to cut our healing a lot. Come on, get that execute, Draven. There it is. Draven's trying. Attaboy, Draven! Or Zed, I mean. Wow, Zed actually stayed alive in the back there. It was really lucky. We still have a bronze Draven, by the way. Not ideal. Maybe we do stop at 7 for a bit. Yeah, maybe we do. Because we need to we need to hit these other duelists. Before we can even put them in. And this way, we're also higher chance of silvering Draven sooner. And he and Zed are kind of our carries at the moment. And we need tank items for Nyla eventually. So far, so good. Okay, a glove. Another recurve. Another recurve. There's the lifesteal if we want it. Here's the Yasuo for seven duelists. We don't need him. Do a couple refreshes, maybe. Silver Fiora. Huh. Okay, I was expecting this to go better, honestly. Um... I actually don't hate our items right here. Yeah, do that. We still have no tank items, but you know, we're getting somewhere. Go get him, Zed. That Sejuani is a problem, obviously. It's a lot of freezing up, but we still got it. We still win. Very nice. We gotta silver this Draven, though, for God's sake. For God's sake. I saw that Sejuani there. Sunfire board, Celestial Blessing, or Makeshift Armor. Let's do Sunfire board. It doesn't reduce their healing by that much anymore. Maybe Celestial so everybody heals a little bit. Or we can make everybody tanky. Makeshift Armor. Alright, we don't have it anyway, so let's take the Kale out for now and get Laser Core instead. Come on, give me the Draven, please. Thank you. That took so much work. Alright, now I'm going to start working towards 8 so we can put in uh, the Vein when we find it. We don't need this Fiora, I don't think. Her gold's not that much better. No, it's not. All right, nuts are flopping. Let's see it. I'm ready. Right on the Draven. That's unfortunate. I like how she turns around. Good. Get her out of here. Oh yeah, nuts are flopping. Not a hundred anymore, are you? Get out of here. Six duels might be enough. We might have to stop there and work on other weaknesses we have instead. Like, we could get Hacker instead and get Zed in the back line right away. That's probably a better play. Honestly. Once we hit 8, that is. Yeah, I think I want to do that. And that way we can keep Sejuani in, because Sejuani's an absolute unit. Egu with the crazy team. He sold the Mordekaiser. He said, no, it's not working for me. Well, wow, Worm needs to put a lot of items down. Or not worm. Um, Egu does. Nice, nice Sejuani alt. Yes, sir. There we go. We are just cooking in this little joke playthrough of ours. Okay. Dan and Fiddle, no. A sword or a chain would be good. I want Edge of Night on Zed, probably. Edge of Night on Zed would be nice, I think. 
I think that's the go. It would give him a lot more survivability, that's for sure. Alright, now we just need to get a chain. And we're just gonna run no tank items, apparently. We're gonna run double carry Draven Zet. Apparently that's that's what we're doing. We could commit now. Yeah, for the sake of keeping our win streak, I'm gonna commit now. Oh, we need that. We need that duelist. No, we need all of them. What am I talking about? All right, there we go. This is our team. I think I want to replace LeBlanc with Zoe, probably. But it's our team, nonetheless. Zed in the back line already. We love that. Uh, I'm about to get eaten by Belveth, but okay. Now it's just the Belveth left, so. And the Zax. Get her done. Yep. Worm Odyssey, dude. You're in trouble. You're in trouble. 5 HP. Not where he wants to be. I think we sell this Kale, right? We don't need it. Another Zed, nice. I'll keep her for now, I guess. There's, I'm not losing anything by keeping her. Hot Pot just disconnected. That's not good for Hot Pot. Gold member is silver to Samira. With Duelist Samira. We've seen how deadly Samira can be, so that's kind of big, actually. Mm. Okay. Wish we had gotten our Zed on the other side here, but alright. We'll get the Samira at least. Good, good, good. Ah, oh, the Sejuani got her ult off. We should still be fine, I, I think. Against Thingleberry here. Nice Zed. Nice Draven. Yep, we got another one. Alright, the dual threat between Zed and Draven is going very well. With 100% crit chance, of course. Being a big part of that. Everybody's still alive. Everybody made it to Aoshin. To Volcanic Soul here. Aurelian Soul, not Aoshin, sorry. So let's see what everybody gets. See if people can stay alive. Nuts of Floppin' and I are at way high HP. Everybody else is down at 23 or lower. So everybody else is starting to run into the danger zone. No, and Needless is... Sir, that is not what I wanted to see. Chain? Chain. There we go. So we ended up with no tank items on the whole team. Alright. There's the Zoe. Alright, Zoe instead of LeBlanc. Um, do we go level do we go level nine? I guess. We're not gonna gold anything by rolling here. And we can get Prankster for the Echo, I guess. I don't think we get Aegis, but... Okay. Sure. We can just drag the horse. That's good to know. Yeah, I guess we just roll. Or, I guess we just level the 9. Get get Prankster in here. We'll Silver Zed eventually. We're not Golding Draven, probably. Just too far away. Oh, Zed's down. The Misfortune's gonna be a problem, I think. Oh, the Ox Force! We got it. Lighten them up. That's two people out. Gold member and Worm Odyssey out in that round. Okay. Maybe I should be Zed, uh, Silvering Zed, though, to be honest. Let me see if I can do it in a little interest. Not looking like it. I tried. Alright, we're still at four interest if we win this fight. Nuts of Floppin's on that side, Kiggs is on that side, so we want Zed on this side. Damn. Alright, let's see if we can eliminate Hot Pot. 
who is still disconnected. Oh, this guy hasn't been able to play. That's so unlucky. And he's still this strong. Isn't that nuts? Hasn't been able to play, and he's still this strong. He had a decent little team there, but now he's out. Those disconnects can be brutal. If Egu loses, he's out. He needs a win here. He did get it. And now Kiggs is on death row. Dingleberry's on death row. Straight, uh, Zed is not coming. Sejuani, we're also looking for. I saw the vein there, and I was thinking about it. No, that's not happening either. There's the Zed. Jesus. That took a lot. We could do eight duelists if we kept going. Hold up. No, eight duelists is overkill. I don't think it actually benefits us as much as just having more frontline does. So let's go for that. Look at the Zed in the back. Just screaming through things. Draven with the lifesteal. Come on. No. We're going to lose. Nuts of Floppin's going to beat us. Ah. Damn. <laughs> oh, damn it. All right. Good to know. We're not strong enough yet. We need more oomph. We need tankiness, too. Probably should have taken the Dragon's Claw, to be honest. Titan's Resolve is fine, though. No, because makeshift armor. I actually don't even want it on her. Damn. That just makes this complicated now. Um, let's silver the Sejuani. Silver the Yasuo. We can do that. Someone's about to get hurt. The Sejuani's not coming. Wow. Well, there goes that, uh... There goes the level 9 plan. Probably not happening now. We had to spend way too much gold to find what we needed. But that's alright. We're still hanging in. Get that misfortune out of here. Come on. Ah, come on, Draven. No. Damn it, we're losing to everybody. This is not good. <laughs> this is not good. Silver Sejuani should help, but that's still not good. We're not strong enough to win fights, and we need to get first to stay alive. <sighs> that's so bad. That's so bad. How do we stay alive here? I don't see a better way to line up on this guy either. Oh no. Oh no! Let's give it another shot. He protected his LeBlanc. His LeBlanc. Wipe things out, Zed. Wipe it out. Zed needs more damage. Our front lines aren't lasting. They're just not lasting. Oh no! I think we're gonna lose! I think this run is over! I don't know how we can even get strong enough to win this, honestly. I don't... I don't... I have no idea. I have no idea, because makeshift armor is making us tankier, so if I put items down, there goes that. How is Yasuo doing at all? Yasuo is useless. Man. Yeah, I don't know. We're going to need something huge to stand a chance here. Egu is out. It's just nuts of flopping an eye. Here we go, everybody. Give it our best go. A Zephyr could be big. Try Zephyr. Maybe we get a good Zephyr, we can make that work. We'll put Yasuo wherever he needs to go to Zephyr people. 
We'll put Draven here so that we can Zephyr the LeBlanc. And if we Zephyr the LeBlanc, I like our odds more. Gold Annie. You gotta be kidding me! And now the Z Gold Zoe has a Thieves Gloves and everything, dude. Oh, they just keep getting stronger and stronger, don't they? Alright, we Zephyr the LeBlanc. We'll see how that helps. And we'll hit level 9 after this fight. LeBlanc is in the back line. Yeah, we can't win this. We can't. Oh, damn it, man. We lose. I, we don't have an answer for this. Oh, dude. Wow. Damn. That's killer, actually. Alright, here we go. Get Zephyr this corner. Got the Zoe. Okay. Okay, now the Zoe's been out for a bit. So let's see how that goes. Nice Sejuani ult there. Zed got tricked over to the other side. Draven's trying. There's just not enough. Oh, well, it's been a good run, everybody, but there's no way we pull this around. We could try Zephyring a frontliner. Did I already say GG well played? Did I say that twice? That's my bad. Could try doing it to a frontliner, I guess. I really don't know other, what other plans we possibly have. If we pop up the Annie, maybe? Let's try popping up the Annie. And then blowing up the Alistair and trying to get onto other targets. Okay. I do like it so far. It is better! The Draven's down. The Draven is down. You did a good job, Zed, but with Draven down, I just don't see it. Okay. How do we keep Draven alive? What is LeBlanc's targeting? I'm not giving up yet. There's gotta be something here. Another trickster? Another prankster? Yes. Alright, Prankster's dummies stun the enemy that killed them for 1.5 seconds. Another echo, please. Wow. There it is. So we can prankster on Gangplank. Alright, now we focus down the Annie first, apparently. I got caught up in other things. But if we blow her up fast, it should still be good. It's not good. That Annie is way too tanky. Ooh, but with Zed on it? Maybe. Blow it up? just casting so quickly. And then with the Ox Force too. It's a good try again, but again just shy of what we need it to be. I just don't see it. I don't see the answer here. We're not Golding Z we're not Golding Draven. Go full out prankster in front. What is the answer? It's not LeBlanc, we've tried that. But I can try it again, I guess? She just gets carried, is the problem.
All right, we got rid of the Annie again. Let's try that. Because that was the best fight, was the Annie one. Um, it's going okay. Nice glacial prison, at least. The Ox Force makes them last so long. We can't kill the LeBlanc. She heals too much. <laughs> We're still alive. Jesus. I don't see an answer. I don't see an answer. This is going to have to be a hell of an item to make a difference. Aegis would be good. Yeah, we could try Aegis, I guess. An Aegis emblem. Um, I don't know. Sorry, guys, but it looks like the joke playthrough is going to be over at three. <laughs> Most of the times we play TFT, you'd be happy with a third play, with a second place, but this one is that's just not enough. Give me a duplicator, no? Uh, Ionic Spark, we could do. Could do Morellos. Try Morellos, I guess. And what is he taking? He took a Warmogs. Yeah, that's good. That's a good take. That's a good take. Golden Draven is... I'm just Hail Marying, basically. I'm gonna switch the front lines again. Because like, he's probably gonna switch it. Interesting. He's got the Annie locked. There's the Nunu, too. Yeah. Yeah, we tried. Alas, it was not to be. Oh, oh my goodness. Well, thank you so much for joining me on this playthrough, everybody. It was a real blast, and there goes the joke. Thank you again so much for being here, and I'm sorry that I played this instead of something else, but it was funny. I enjoyed it. I hope you did, too.